Well, when will criminals realize cameras are everywhere? Take a look at some home surveillance video we have tonight, and you can see that woman, she's got blonde hair, walks right up to the porch, walks off with a package. Kind of sneaks away, in fact. Well, it turns out that package was an Amazon.com order of coffee and ice trays worth a whopping 22 bucks. Not on your side's Maggie Vespa, live tonight on the east side. Maggie, turns out this is happening all over the place. Yeah, Jen, apparently no porch is safe. Tucson police tell us packages are lifted from local porches like these roughly once a week. So what can you do if you fall victim? Well, first, watch this Phoenix area man story. And second, take notes. Call it a special delivery that no one would sign for. There was this woman at my door. Perhaps a neighbor in need of some sugar? Nope, not even close. A broad daylight burglary caught on surveillance cam. The loot? Ice trays that make perfectly square ice cubes for like cocktails or even, now that I think about it, iced coffee. I could have made iced coffee. Understandably distraught, Tim Lake it's set up a distances. tip line and plastered posters. It won't happen again, not as long as we're getting the word out. Describing the culprit as? Eyes, vacant, uncaring, lacking a soul, height. About yay. Lake says he's not hopeful cops will catch the quote blonde Sasquatch, but he wants to spread the word that this threat is everywhere. And we didn't have to go far to find someone in the Tucson area whose packages have been pilfered. Kevin, I hear you have a story. I'm a victim too. Turns out, not on your side's own, Kevin Keen lost a pair of earbuds to a porch pilfering punk. Someone else is listening to music right now with. Thieves' ears. And how much were these earbuds worth? $13.40. But who's counting? Kevin. Kevin is. So is Britt Adams. Thieves swiped a set of custom made dash mats from his Saurita porch last year. What's more? And about a month later, I found them on Craigslist. I wanted to call the guy. <laughs> Did you? No, I did not. Adams filed a police report. Luckily, the manufacturer was sympathetic. They shipped us out a new set. Still, for victims like Adams, Kevin, and Lake, the pain no, remains of the package that never came. I will find you, and I will convict you. I love Kevin Kane going for an Oscar in that story. Meanwhile, some tips to avoid this porch problem. Police say try to have someone at your home around the time the package is set to be delivered. If you can't do that, try to have it sent to a neighbor's address or even to work. And honestly, if the, if the item is that expensive, they say, insurance definitely goes a long way. Live on the east side, I'm Maggie Vespa. Okay, gun nine on your side. Too bad none of those guys had a sense of humor. Maggie, thank you.